freeze a party, come move around like a fresh fresh when the school is out, when the booze is up, when the sun is down. What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome to Summer Hill, Atlanta. This is a super sweet up and coming area about a mile south of downtown, like not even a mile. Let me show you how close we are to the city. See the street right here? This right here is the skyline, you can see it. It's pretty cool. Today is May 31st, we're going inside right now to sign some papers and collect our keys for a brand new apartment. All right guys, this is live. We are walking into our new apartments for the very first time. This is the moment we have been waiting for. Let's see, which way do we go? Yep, further down this hall right here. You got the keys, right? Locked and loaded, ready to go. Let's see, moment of truth is what we expect. Okay. Well, first guess we gotta open it. Yes, sir. Welcome home to our new apartment. Let's go, baby. This is crazy, man. This is like the start of a brand new chapter. And take a good look while the place is still unfurnished. We are the first tenants of our units because this building is brand spanking new. You can still smell the paint on the walls, can't you? You have that brand new fresh apartment smell, it's it's fantastic. The size of this apartment is about 840, 850 square feet, somewhere around there, so I think it's a really good size for a one bedroom. This is the bathroom, really spacious, and this bathtub has like 10 foot ceilings. And then coming into the bedroom here, check this out, check out this closet, dude. This closet could be a whole nother bedroom or den. I could quite literally put my desk right here. Let me give you guys a full tour of our place right now. Keep this video rolling. I hope you enjoy another video today. Let's go. Alright, welcome to our new place. Super excited to introduce you to it. I think I got a sweet deal on this place. First of all, the base rent was reasonable. There's very few, I think, units this nice, this close to the city, under two grand. Our base rent is right under two grand, if you're curious. Everything is really new, really updated. Like I mentioned, they just finished building this complex recently. As you can see, the kitchen is massive. I love these dark stained wood cabinets, as well as the granite countertops. Sweet stove there, and it is gas, by the way, not electric, which I know some people preference a nice stainless steel fridge as are the rest of the appliances. Moving into the living room, as you can see here, the paint on one of the walls, I'm looking around actually, all the walls are like this, this light gray off-white color, which I think really is beneficial for the overall appearance of the unit. is isn't just white, which can look pretty plain, but instead it's that light gray, however, it's still enough where you can add your own color and build around it. So, totally cool there. I think I got a sweet uh, gig on this place because since I moved in on May 31st, this place had a special where if you move in by May 31st, you get six weeks free rent, half rent in the months of July, August, and September, as well as a $500 Visa debit card to use on whatever. So as you saw, there are tons of closet space as you walk through the hallway, as well as in sweet washer and dryer. Here is a shot of the bathroom for you. The ceilings in this bathroom are ridiculous. I think I said 10 feet, however, I, they might be 12 feet. Like they're huge. And another closet it in the bathroom as well. Storage is the number one factor in this place, at least compared to our last one. There is so much storage in this unit, it's ridiculous. Moving into the bedroom, the bedroom honestly is a little bit smaller than other units of this square foot. That's just because they made the bathroom and the closet so massive. However, I think it's perfect size for us. Cannot complain there. And moving into this walk-in closet, it is huge again, at least compared to our last place. It is huge. I love that built-in storage to the walls right there. Yeah, I am in love with our, with our new apartment. Man, this is it. We are getting professional movers to move all of our big stuff. For now, we got a bunch of stuff in boxes and suitcases just to move the little things. We're super excited to get this process going. This is our new home, baby. The start of a brand new chapter. So let's fast forward a few days and get to these movers. I see colors for the first time. I'm starting to realize nothing's ever black and white. And I'm caught up in the first night. Now it doesn't feel right. I'll just have to say Last time. I 
Back at the old spot, all done moving everything over to our new place. I got the moving company Bellhop. I got a couple quotes from companies around the area and Bellhop was the best deal. So I went with them. Five star out of five stars, absolutely. All we got left here is some pillows, blankets, extra laundry, detergent, and some dishes. So taking this last batch over to the new place. This is the last scene I'm ever gonna film living in this apartment. And it's been one crazy ride the last year. I really hope you enjoyed it if you followed along from the time I moved here from downtown Atlanta to the time Scott moved in with me about a month later through Halloween and Christmas and having a bunch of dogs here and Easter and then into the summer. It's been really, really fantastic. I'm definitely gonna miss this place even though it's freaking crammed all the time with two of us and half of the year a dog living here. So, hope you enjoyed it. Let's get back over to the new place right now. I will show you guys some of the amenities. All right, let me show you guys some of the amenities at our place. First of all, this is one of the courtyards. Super nice area to chill and lounge. Lots of nice chairs and benches and uh, seating built into the wall there. Moving into the pool area, it is a resort style pool in the middle of the complex. Really nice, not that big, but honestly, I'm not a huge pool guy. I've only been in my pool in my last place maybe three or four times in the last year. Just a nice place to hang around. Here is the dog park outside. Little agility course there around the corner from the dog park is this uh, swing that me and Scott will use maybe every single day. Just a, a little feature that is super cool. Moving into this area, this is right off the end of the lobby. Uh, more areas to lounge and chill and work. They have lots of good spaces for specifically work as a worker remote has become pretty popular within the last year or two. And check this out, there is a recording studio for podcasts. I mean, I don't know if I'm gonna use it. I mean, I, be, with that being there, I think I might use it a little bit. Maybe to start a little podcast as a, as a second video on the side, we'll see. But here is the, the gym, really nice free bench at the apartment gym, and that in itself makes it all the worthwhile. This is another one of the club rooms here. I had to make a quick pit stop and get lined up by my dude Caleb. Pretty good, as always, he's been cutting my hair for two years since I moved to Atlanta. Anyways, let's get back to the plate, hold on. Something, a little dust on my lens. Let me clean that really quick. All right, rough draft. Uh, the first day of moving in is always just get everything in in a somewhat organized fashion. So rough draft tour of our place. Right now, my desk is in the living room facing out the window. When it's all said and done, when we have a full couch in here like this, that is most likely gonna be moved into our bedroom. From my last place, we scrapped the couch and the coffee table, and I think we're gonna scrap this TV stand as well. It's just super bulky and it's super old. We're gonna move this TV into our bedroom and buy a new one eventually along with a new TV stand. So this is here for now, but that will absolutely be changed eventually. All this stuff on the kitchen island, we're gonna move somewhere. You know, we're just trying to figure out where to put everything. These decorations up here look pretty nice. I think this top shelf up here, that is eventually gonna be a bunch of different assortments of liquor. I hardly drink liquor anymore, like a couple times throughout the year. However, I think purely for fashion, purely for show, if I had a bunch of variety bottles up there, that looked pretty cool. And I think arguably my favorite part about the whole unit is that all the drawers and cabinets are non-slam, which means when you close it after using it, it closes very slowly instead of slamming shut. See, makes no noise. So Scott, when you're pissed at me about doing whatever, you can't just go slamming the cabinets out of frustration because guess what? They don't slam. Got our bed set up in our bedroom. Absolutely gonna add in more decorations all around the room so that's not even close to being finished. And then in the closet, it's so big that half of our walk-in closet is gonna be used for our dog, which will be moving in with us in a couple of months. Scholar has put together some kind of decorations here for the dog, and this dog bed is absolutely gonna be upgraded. So, really good start to moving in. Lots of work done today on day one. It won't be over to the fat lady sings.
One more amenity of this place I forgot to show you is the sweet view of the skyline looking from the roof deck. Check it out right now. Check out this view, really sweet. A sweet view of downtown I haven't really seen before. I will be chilling up here plenty of times, filming this on YouTube, looking at this view. Also right next to the old Turner Field right here. Really cool. So if you've been following my channel for a while, then you'll know that I've done a ton of videos on Atlanta apartment touring, looking for our next spot. I've toured all over the cities, probably 15 to 20 places in Midtown, Buckhead, West Midtown, Inman Park, Reynolds Town, you know, all over. But I never toured any in Summer Hill until the very last one. We were about 99% set on one of the places in Reynolds Town, but there's still something in the back of our head telling us to go tour one more. So we hit up our friend Carson Bassetta, who is a realtor for apartments here in the Atlanta area, and he said, bro, just give it a shot, go check out Summer Hill. We went to tour this place and we fell in love. It was an absolute perfect place for both of us. So we applied one hour after we got home from the tour and eventually got accepted. Crazy how things work. Could have saved a lot of time, a lot of hassle, not touring all those different places, but we are so happy here now. Scott, are you happy here? Yes, I hope so because we actually got a 15 month lease. It's gonna take us through the end of August of 2024. So we are here for a while. We're super excited to kick off this next chapter of our lives. If you notice, I did not say the specific name of the apartment complex we are at. That's just cause I don't want anyone like deliberately stalking me. However, if you're curious, I promise you, I gave you enough hints throughout this video. If you do a quick Google search, you will find out within 15 seconds where we're at if you're interested in checking it out also. Also DM me on Instagram if you'd like to, love to share some more details on there. Stay tuned as we furnish our apartments. It's gonna take probably the good majority of the summer to get this thing all 100% completed. Gotta go out and buy a bunch of new stuff and decorate it. Once it is fully furnished, I will give you guys a full furnished apartment tour. So super excited for that. In the meantime, I really hope you enjoyed another video today. If you did, make sure you drop me a thumbs up. Also subscribe to my channel if you haven't because I drop a new video every single Monday that you don't want to miss. See you next Monday.